Hello, hi techies, it's Enam here with the Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge. I'm really excited for this device because I've been rocking the S6 Edge for the majority of 2015, so I can't wait to actually get this in my hands and get a feel for it, see how improved it is over the previous generation. For the Mumbo Jumbo, you can pause the video now. Let's get this out the way and get this seal busted open. Now this device is IP68 certified, so should be water resistant. And if we can get it out here, ah, oh, look at that. Black Onyx, Samsung are calling this. So let's see if we can get this out. We'll leave it to one side here and see what else we've got out the box. If you lift out the tray here, we have got some reading material. And I wish Samsung would actually stop actually giving out reading material because no one reads it. I never read it. You've got some health and safety information, how you can use the USB connector. You've got the SIM card tray jack tool here, as you can see. Again, as I say, quick start guide, warranty info, all that mumbo jumbo stuff, which we'll leave to one side. Standard stuff, three pin UK power adapter, quick charge with a USB connector the other side. Micro USB to standard USB data transfer and charging cable. And they've also included, if the camera will focus in here, a micro USB connector so you can transfer from device to device, which is pretty cool that they've included this. And we've also got, if I can get the earphones out here in this completely clear case. There we go, getting those out of the way here. And this should unclip open if it flies everywhere you know i've done it wrong so leave that in there as you can see standard looking samsung earbuds samsung branding with some chrome accents and you've got the silla sil silicone bud here which feels pretty good to be fair and we've got some inline controls here as i say not too different from previous generations and you've got the standard three pin audio jack so we'll leave that to one side here as well but the man himself the samsung galaxy s7 edge that does look good how cool does that look oh it's surprisingly lighter than what i thought it was going to be to be honest so let's see if we can get this off here and the front as well you ready you ready here we go. Don't know if the camera actually picked up on that, but it was good, believe me. So, Black Onyx Samsung is calling this. And this is the 32 gigabyte variant. At the time of ordering, there was no other variant, so this is the only one pretty much you can get. And it was either gold or Black Onyx, and I obviously went for Black Onyx. And as you can see, fingerprint magnet, pretty much. Since the time that I've taken it out, we've already got some smudges here. Let me get this off. You can see that bump along the rear is not so great for that 12 megapixel shooter with a 1.7 aperture. So this should be able to take very, very good photos indeed. And you can see the smudges slowly coming in here. We can always get a skin for this. Along the top, the secondary noise cancelling microphone and the SIM card as well as a micro SD card tray. Yes, the micro SD card comes back for the S7. The volume buttons along the left hand side are like this slim form factor of these buttons. I did always like them even from the S6 Edge. Very, very cool indeed. Get a feel for that edge. Hopefully you can see that. If the camera decides to focus in here, and not the reflection of my hand. So yeah, that looks really, really cool to be fair. Speaker towards the right here, secondary noise country microphone, micro USB and 3.5 millimeter audio jack. Power button still retains its permission along the right hand side. And I gotta admit, it feels really good in the hand. It feels lighter than certainly the S6. 
and uh, the home button is slightly larger obviously than the, the previous generation here and there's not as much travel less of a bump as you can see very very nice indeed i've just set up the device so this is ready to rock but i just thought i'd show you look at the back here what a fingerprint magnet so i'll have to get a skin on here pretty quick but anywho you got the s7 super amoled capacitive touchscreen here quad hd absolutely amazing looking i love amoled displays so popping are the colors and very deep blacks but the display look at that it looks like it just flows off the side of the screen which is why i love the edge variant very very cool indeed so we'll take it off auto i do like that a lot and let's see what it's running well get rid of that it should be running marshmallow see if we can go down to software info and yeah 6.0.1 android marshmallow running on this brand new galaxy s7 edge and as i say this is ip68 certified as is the other regular samsung galaxy s7 so a dip in water shouldn't hurt it at all and i love it because there's no gaskets on here all the ports are fully open this is how a water resistant handset should be feels premium minus the smudges obviously but yeah absolutely awesome looking i can't wait to get to use this as a daily driver and that's been a quick unboxing as ever any comments or questions you guys have got hit them up in the comment section down below please like subscribe and tag along on social media at inam thanks for watching have a wicked day and i'll see you next time